Hey guys, so I just wanted to talk about my background a little bit. So before I moved to America, I taught starting from pre-K all the way up to adults. Um, more heavily, I guess, I taught a lot of elementary school students. That was my main. But I do have experience teaching all ages. And one thing that I learned when I was teaching was I would observe my students pretty well. Sometimes I just wanted to let them figure it out because, you know, that is the most important part about teaching. I would just watch them, just watch their habits. Um, how do they solve problems that they have? And what kind of individual characteristics does each student have? And based on those characteristics, they could be skills, they could be weaknesses. I started learning that each student has a certain pattern. And in order to be a good teacher, I need to kind of predict what kind of pattern they're going to show when they're faced with an issue. And my job as a teacher isn't to boss them around or dictate what they're going to do because each student's learning style is different. Depending on their personality, I kind of know what to expect. And if they need help, then I'm there to give them the help, advice, and support before they falter. And that's, you know, the reason I do that is to instill confidence I want them to become a confident person so when they go to school or when they go out to the real world, I need them to be able to figure it out on their own. So that's what I did. And you know, if you watch people carefully, if they make a mistake once, they're going to make it again, most likely. And when they make it again, that becomes again and again, and eventually... They keep on making the same mistakes so many times and because no one has really pointed out anything to them or provided them with a sufficient guidance, they're just going to accept it as their fate. You know, oh, I guess this is just, you know, this is the best I can do. I mean, what are we going to do about it? They're not going to be able to find a solution. So my main goal was before they made that mistake, when I'm giving them instructions on what to do, I'm already giving them all the materials that they need. And that might be a friendly reminder of what they need to be doing. It could be very detailed written instructions or notes that I want to provide them. But regardless, I think I use the similar mindset when it comes to managing my team members at work because I am a manager. I base my feedback off of what kind of behavior or characteristics I've seen from my colleagues. And then before they make the same mistake again, if I've already seen the same kind of pattern two or three times, then I'm going to start stepping in before that happens so that they don't make the same mistake again. And that's how I feel like I can help them. And I use the same kind of mindset when it comes to running the channel, my YouTube channel. I feel like I'm not here to dictate or get on top of you guys and boss you around and saying, hey, this is what you need to do. I feel like my approach is more a little bit laid back. I like to kind of watch how people interact. And based off of that, kind of like a profile is being made. So for those who are commenting quite a few times, I'm going to remember what they've said in the past. And based off of that, a profile is kind of made for each person. So for those who have commented let's say like more than three four times I'm gonna 
remember what people say, and then you know, based on that, I'll cater my comments to that individual commenter on my channel, because I kind of have an idea of building in my mind what kind of person they are, what are their likes, dislikes, have they talked about their cat, what does their cat look like. What is the name of their cat? You know, what kind of area, you know, country or what state in the United States they live. Those kind of small little details I do kind of remember when I am responding back to individuals on my channel. So yeah, that's kind of how I use my previous work history. And I found out, oh, I can incorporate that into running this channel as well. So yeah, that's a little history about me, you guys. And that's why I do feel confident that I can run this channel well. I'm very consistent. And I hope you guys like what you've been seeing because Coco and I love posting videos every single day. Coco especially likes listening to me talk because she relaxes and she goes to sleep. It's like a lullaby. So yeah, that's it for today's video. Thanks, you guys.